Hello friends, it's Kick with you, and in today's episode we have some exciting updates. Mercedes-Benz has unveiled a prototype of the electric Gelendewagen with a tank turn feature. Hyundai showcased an innovative wheel rotation system in action. An unusual delivery bot from Mobin, a serial electric air taxi with a range of 64 kilometers, a new version of the home robot Bally with a built-in projector from Samsung, and a Chinese startup that successfully launched the world's most powerful solid fuel rocket on its first attempt. All this and much more right now, let's go! Today we start our episode with one of the most anticipated events in the world of cars, the CES 2024 exhibition in magnificent Las Vegas. We begin with the car that caught our attention, the rugged German from Mercedes-Benz. This car, designated as EQG, is an electric version of the famous Gelendewagen, or simply G-Class. Mercedes-Benz has long dreamed of creating an electric version of this legendary SUV, and at CES 2024 they presented a pre-production variant that's already stirring a storm of impressions. The EQG will be equipped with four electric motors Motors, one for each wheel, allowing it to rotate in place like a real tank. This means that it will be unmatched on even the most difficult roads. It retains the characteristic exterior of the G-Class, with the iconic square shape and square grille at the front. However, despite its mass and power, Mercedes-Benz has not forgotten about environmental aspects. We hope to see the EQG on the road soon and learn more about its technical specifications and prices. But one thing is already clear, Mercedes-Benz has taken a big step towards electric mobility while maintaining the spirit and style of the legendary G. Class. Stay tuned for our updates to be in the know about the latest news from CES 2024. And then there's Honda, which has unveiled its new series of electric cars named Zero. These aren't just electric cars, they are a burst of futurism and innovation. We present to your attention two absolutely stunning conceptual pieces, the minivan space hub and the sedan saloon. If you think the future looks grim and faceless, Honda Zero will surely change your mind. Both these vehicles look as if they have flown from the future to conquer today's roads. And don't think it's just for show. Honda is ready to turn its conceptual dream into reality. In the coming years, we will see a production version of the less inventive of these cars. Also, get ready for a new Honda logo symbolizing the beginning of a new era. This logo will shine only on next-generation electric vehicles, reminding us that the future is already here. And if you think Honda will stop at just a stylish appearance, you are deeply mistaken. These electric cars will be like Formula One on the roads, using sporty design and advanced technologies. It's also important to note that Honda will do everything to make your driving as efficient and comfortable as possible. They are developing the e-axle system, which will convert electric power into maximum power and movement efficiency. Level 2 autonomous driving on the Honda Sensing platform is also part of the plan. And don't forget about artificial intelligence, which will collect data about you and your preferences to create a truly personal driving experience and provide the most convenient routes. Hyundai has just opened the door to the future for us. Their innovative wheel rotation system is a true revolution in the automotive world. You probably remember that in 2021, Hyundai Mobis presented a concept car that could rotate in place by a full 180 degrees. It was like something out of a science fiction movie. But now this fantastic future is becoming a reality. The e-corner system is a true marvel of engineering thought. This module combines braking, steering, suspension, and an electric motor on each wheel, all controlled by a single system. Now your wheels can move in any direction you like. Want to park sideways between cars? No problem. Want to make a full turn on the move? You are generously given such an opportunity. And yes, you understood correctly, this can even be used to help other drivers and pedestrians on the road. Hyundai Mobis has developed an auxiliary projector that projects the direction of the car's movement onto the asphalt. And that's not all. They can also create a light image of pedestrian crossing so that robo cars can safely stop and let pedestrians pass. Hyundai is not just creating cars. They are creating a future where cars become true allies in everyday life. And we can't wait to see how this technology changes the world of road traffic. Let's move on. At the CES 2024 Tech Exhibition, they presented the courier robot Mobin, also belonging to Hyundai. Its main feature is flexible wheels. The robot's massive wheels bend, but the hinged frame supports them from the inside and prevents them from completely losing shape. With their help, it can easily climb and descend any stairs in its path. The new Mobin can work without recharging for 8 hours. The bot has a large compartment for products. It is located on a movable platform, which can change the angle of inclination if necessary. Mechanical couriers are already undergoing tests in real condition. They deliver orders on the streets of South Korea. In addition, the company Supernal, a division of electric aircraft of the Hyundai Corporation, presented the SA2 Air Taxi at the International CES 2024 exhibition in Las Vegas. The vertical takeoff and landing vehicle is designed for four passengers, can travel up to 64 km on a single charge, and fly at a speed of 200 km IH. The first concept of Hyundai's Air Taxi, named SA1, was introduced exactly four years ago at CES 2020. It was conceived as a fully electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft suitable for any flights 
over urban buildings. To provide the necessary characteristics, the company's engineers chose the ConvertiPlane design, an aircraft whose propellers turn vertically during takeoff and landing. SuperNAL, a Hyundai division, is responsible for developing urban air mobility solutions. Over four years, the concept has evolved into a full-scale electric ConvertiPlane with a V-shaped tail and eight propellers, four on each wing with a separate motor for each propeller. The front propellers tilt upwards, the rear ones downwards. During horizontal movement in cruise flight, the front row becomes the pulling propeller and the rear one, the pushing propeller. Hyundai plans to use the existing industrial capacities of the group for serial production to ensure high quality without raising the price too much. An application for SA2 certification in the United States is to be filed in the middle of this year, with test flights scheduled to begin at the end of 2024. The official launch of the SuperNAL air taxi service is set for 2028. The company Holoconex has developed an original device, similar to a phone booth, inside of which is a realistic hologram of the interlocutor or a pre-recorded digital avatar. ZDNet journalist tested the new product and published his impressions in a video format. The Holobox booth, powered by AI algorithms, displays a hologram of a person at each end of the line. For a quality image, the user needs to be well lit and stand against a white canvas. An 86-inch display with an anti-glare coating is responsible for displaying the holograms and a pair of speakers for the sound. Holobox needs only a socket and internet access to work. According to the developers, the device is already being used by the UN, UNICEF, Nike, BMW, Vodafone Deloitte, and T-Mobile. The price and the start date of retail sales of the Devis have not yet been announced. Samsung brought an updated version of the companion robot Belly to CES 2024. The device has received many useful features for remote smart home control, pet care, and multimedia entertainment. The main change in the new version of Belly is a built-in projector. With it, the robot can project an image onto any surface, including the floor, wall, or ceiling, with automatic alignment of the picture depending on the used screen. Moreover, the device can connect to smart home appliances and control them. The robot will independently turn on the lights, air conditioning, or start the washing machine, and then send a report to the user about the work done. The gadget owner can also monitor their pet using a built-in camera and, if necessary, even activate an automatic feeder through Bally. The company notes that the novelty constantly studies the behavior models and habits of users to provide smarter and more personalized services. Bally was first introduced in 2020, but the robot has not been on sale since then. And what would Kik be without space? The Chinese startup Orion Space, created only in 2020, successfully launched a giant solid fuel rocket from a sea platform off the coast of Haiyan in Shandong province, breaking the record for the payload capacity of Chinese commercial rockets. The Gravity One rocket was launched from the mobile sea platform Defu 15002 in the Yellow Sea on January 11th. Soon after the start, the company reported the successful delivery of all devices to the target orbits. The US Space Force's space control system confirmed the successful deployment of three Yunyao One satellites in orbits ranging from 478 to 499 kilometers with an inclination of 49.99 degrees. The satellites belong to Yunyao Yuhang, which is creating a constellation for global weather and earthquake forecasting. The Gravity One rocket can launch up to 30 satellites weighing 100 kilos each. The rocket is currently the most powerful in the industry in terms of launch power. It is also the first rocket to successfully make its debut launch from the sea and one of the few to reach orbit on the first try. Many commercial companies have decided to first develop develop light solid fuel rockets and then move on to reusable liquid fuel rockets. Orion Space plans to launch its first liquid fuel rocket in 2025. The 60 meter tall Gravity 2 will have a main stage and solid fuel boosters. The first stage of the rocket will be equipped with nine Yuanli 85 kerosene gas generator engines with a thrust of 100 tons each. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to not miss a fresh portion of handpicked news. Goodbye.